Hello, my name is Kimberly Church. I am the World Languages Department Chair. In Spanish 2 Pre-AP, the students incorporate their strong independent study skills. They demonstrate a willingness to go beyond the class um, and expand their use of the language in a personalized manner. Um, this prepares students who are on the AP track, though you do not have to continue to go towards AP if you don't want. Um, you'll continue to acquire the language through readings, through listenings, and digital media um, and a variety of those things. We do a lot of projects um, that are relevant tasks with real world scenarios um, and we invent and we create and we collaborate and we do it all in the target language. It's really awesome. Hope to see you there. Pre-AP Spanish 2 is definitely a boost from on-level Spanish 1 because of the additional workload you get from the projects and the presentations. However, a lot of the work that we had wasn't um, assigned from the teacher. A lot of it was us preparing for upcoming tests and projects and making sure that we had everything prepared. What I really enjoyed about pre -AP Spanish 2 is that we had to present really creatively and you had to um, bring out your own individual in your presentations. I really enjoyed like broadening my scope of Spanish. I learned about history, to like math directions and I really enjoyed the projects we did and I, it really improved my presentational speaking because we did so many projects and presentations. So in level three, Spanish, Spanish pre-AP three, and this course focuses on the delivery of content through thematic units while expanding that relevant vocabulary, um, refining the accuracy of expression, learning new structures. Uh, the focus of this course is developing the intermediate mid proficiency level. Um, the majority of this course is conducted entirely in the target language. Uh, the teacher will help scaffold the kids there. It's an awesome class. They learn language structures in context and use them to convey meaning as well as explore culture in both contemporary and historical contexts and um, they actively communicate in a variety of settings it is a lot of fun a lot of kids who are taking the Spanish level 3 pre AP course are on the AP track to take it the next year at this point the student is communicating in the target language every single class whether they are listening and conveying meaning in the interpretive modes they are speaking they are writing uh, they have communicative fluency and they have a little bit more than communicative fluency it's a lot of fun we do a lot of projects and hope to see you there so Spanish 3 is a lot more, um, you know, by Spanish 3 you already know the language so at this point it's just about finding different ways to utilize it for our class specifically, we've focused a lot on culture and just learning about the history and incorporating Spanish into our daily lives and less just here's how to speak a language, but more how to utilize the language. And also in Spanish 3 or Spanish 3 Pre-AP, we learn more about how to use in our essays, how it could benefit us during our writings and our talking and just in our public lives and just out in the world in general. So Spanish 3, you receive a lot of help from the teacher because, you know, as you go on, it definitely gets more difficult, but um, the teacher is really able to, by this time, um, you're kind of able to create like a plan for yourself of how am I going to succeed in this class because you're learning so many different things that chances are there's going to be something that's harder for you than a different topic. So the teacher really supports you and you get like a space where you can write all the vocabulary words you've learned and then you get readings about current events and past events so it's a really cool way by this time you really get to bond with your teacher not just over Spanish but over your life in general. So in AP Spanish 4, we are addressing the language through the AP themes. This is an approved course with an approved syllabus through the College Board. It is taught at an intermediate level, college level. Um, it also uh, will incorporate all of the modes of communication that we've been working on, listening, speaking, interpersonal writing, interpersonal speaking, all kinds of things like that. The class is taught completely in the target language in Spanish. Um, it is a wonderful course course uh, most kids who go and take the course they feel really comfortable with taking the AP exam LT has a 100% passing rate on the AP Spanish exam um, all fours and higher so we have a really strong course and we hope that you will consider it and we'll see you there 
In AP Spanish 4, we do a lot of projects that have to do with various topics, like, for example, social media and the internet, technology and science, and just the environment, just different kind of topics about the world itself. And we look at it through a kind of perspective, a Hispanic perspective and then a American perspective. So we do uh, interpersonal speakings, we do interpersonal writings, we do formal essay writings, and we do like reading comprehension for multiple choice kind of stuff. And it's it just all, each thing kind of goes back to one of those themes and overall it's just a really fun class.